So the Cornwallis Stakes is next there. And look at this thunder and lightning coming down there. And it's a five furlong group through. The top one is Look and Floor for Joshua Sullivan. Duke of Lancaster for Darren Thompson. Hurricane Quest for Jim Murray. Quacker Talk for Molly Et Surfer. Peppery for Graham Clutterbuck. And St. Bafisic for Carla Ragan. So just six. And six wet jockeys on board as they race away then. And the most... Um, appropriate winner would probably be Hurricane Quest, wouldn't it? With weather like this, but it's Look and Floor. He's probably just in the lead, but Hurricane Quest is now going on into the lead. So, Hurricane Quest it is from St. Bafisic. Then comes Duke of Lancaster, Look and Floor, and Quacker Twock. And finally, Peppery is just the back marker. Hurricane Quest it is then. Who leads by about three lengths to Quacker Twock in second. So this season we've got the weirdest of names we've ever had, I think. Especially Vinnie Gerard, who's not in this race, got some really interesting ones. But we're down to the final third and a half, and it's Hurricane Quest in the lead then from Quackatock in second. Then comes Look and Floor, uh, Duke of Lancaster, Pepper is after that one, but Hurricane Quest is living up to the weather at the moment. It's now being swept aside by Duke of Lancaster. And Duke of Lancaster now being attacked by Look and Floor, Look and Floor on the inside, Look and Floor just about, oh, that's on the nod, that's close. Look and Floor, Duke of Lancaster, it's a win for Look and Floor for Josh Russell, Duke of Lancaster for Darren Thompson, second, Peppery for Graham Cousin, third, Quacker Twock for Hyatt <laughs> Surfer was fourth, and St. Bafisic for Carla Agante was fifth, and Hurricane Quest, the most appropriate lamp horse in the race, ended up last.